Well, come on in out of that uh, cold, snowy weather that we're having today. Well, actually, it was, uh, I think it was in the 60s today. Probably going to be in the 60s tomorrow. But anyway, uh, come on in. Let's take a look at your inspection report. So stay with me. Okay, now let's take a look at the inspection report and see how it reads out. This is a generic report. This is exactly what you will get, only your information obviously will be filled into all these blanks. The upper right-hand corner of the report is the legend. Each one of these initials pertain to something. A is consistent with the age of the chimney. B, C comments below. C, repairs needed. D, need further evaluation or E, not applicable. And they're placed into the boxes next to the parts of the chimney that can be easily identified in this diagram. And then, of course, you'll find my comments here below. Now, let's take a look at your particular, your personal report. So stay with me. Hey, Donna. It was great to see you out at the house today. What a uh, nice house. Great location, too, by the way. Let's go inside. So it's uh, an all-black fireplace. It's got a little um, uh, heat claiming grate in here. Actually, what it does is it pulls cool air in from the room down here at the uh, fan box, uh, push, pushes it through the grate and back out into the room. And so it's uh, heating up the uh, heating up the air so you're getting some hot air from that uh, from that fire that's kind of neat back wall the firebox got some cracks in it um, and uh, it can either be rebuilt or repaired whatever your choice would be on that flu system looks great these flu joints are nice and tight we like to see that chimney cap up on top keeping the creatures out that's a good thing some cracks here in the crown that needs to be uh, either caulked or the crown needs to be re-poured, whatever your choice would be on that. Folks have questions for me, give me a call, 704-526-6348. You can email me at chris at affordablesweep.com.